two identical bodies in which charges are 40 micro coulomb and minus 20 micro coulomb. They are some distance apart. Now they are touched and kept at the same distance. The ratio of the initial to the final force between them is. So here initially two charges 40 micro coulomb and minus 20 micro coulomb. These two charges separated some distance apart. So initial separation let it be R. 40 micro coulomb and minus 20 micro coulomb. Let the distance of separation between the two charges R. So electrostatic force in between these two charges F equals to 1 by 4 by epsilon naught. Product of charges 40 into 20 by square of the distance of separation between the two charges. Let it be equation 1. And later these two charges touched with each other. One is positive charge and the second one is negative charge. So the resultant charge becomes to 20 micro coulomb. Again these two charges separated a distance. So it is distributed to 10 micro coulomb and 10 micro coulomb. So later these two charges separated to the same distance. First charge 10 micro coulomb. Second charge also 10 micro coulomb. And distance of separation between the two charges same R. Now electrostatic force in between these two charges F E dash is equals to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught. 10 into 10 by R square equation 2. So here we want the ratio of initial to the final force between them. So, equation 1 by equation 2. Fe by Fe dash is equals to here 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught cancelled with each other. And here R square R square also cancelled with each other. Then 40 into 20 by 10 into 10. Then 0, 0 cancel. Here also 0, 0 cancel. So 8 by 1. So the ratio of the forces Fe is to Fe dash is equals to 8 is to 1. So the correct option. First option is correct. 8 is to 1.